Hey YouTube, it's me, it's your iPhone Captain. Today's the big day, guys, we've all been waiting for. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Um, we got the untethered jailbreak. And I know a lot of you have been wanting to get this. I have links and everything in the description below where you can download this right now from iPhoneCaptain.com. So be sure to head on over there and get your download for Windows and Mac, either one. We are doing it on the Mac, but it's no different on Windows, just the same. So let's go ahead and let me show you what it's about. If you if you jailbroke iOS 6, then this works the same way. It's a very simple jailbreak, just a couple clicks, and you're finished. So let's go ahead and let me show you right now that we are running on a non-jailbroken device. All right. And you can see I've turned on my mirroring. So we're going to go in here to the settings. And I guess you probably can tell just by looking that it's iOS 7. But anyway, we'll show it to this, the non-believers. Right there you go, right there down at the bottom, 7.0.4. So there you go, guys. That is the jailbroken, the non-jailbroken version. So now let's go in here and let's get started. I've got evasions already downloaded. And you see I got my little desktop thing there already up and running. So let's jailbreak this thing and get it going. So now we can click open. We're already connected with USB, so we don't even have to do that. All we got to do is click the jailbreak button. So I'm going to go ahead and get these so you can see what's going on over here on the device. I'm just wiggling the screen. That was me, so it wasn't shut off on us. But anyway... I'm just sort of swiping through the different, I don't want you guys, but it may kick off anyway. There will be nothing I can do about it here in a minute. But um, I apologize for the audio quality of the video. I had some problems with my microphone, and I wanted to go ahead and rush this video out because I was very excited. I even jumped right up out of bed when I got the email saying that it had been released. Uh, I made a statement in a previous video, I think, that it would be released by Christmas. What do you know? For once in my life, I was right about something. And that was just pure luck, guys. I don't know any more than you guys do, so don't think that. So what I'll probably do is speed up through some of this so you don't have to sit through all of it. So let's go ahead and do that. And now it's rebooting the device. So... The uh, device has shut off. And now it's coming back on, so we'll see what happens. And once it come, everything comes back up, I will, uh, I'll pull it back up on the screen and let you see what's happening. And you can see this one here works the same way. We have to unlock and tap the uh, screen for the evasion. It puts the little icon on there. So I'm tapping the evasion icon now like it asked me to do. Now it's rebooting again. So that's pretty much only the physical part of the jailbreak I'm going to assume so far that I've seen. You'll have to unlock the device and tap the little evasion icon that it puts on your springboard. Once it does that, I, if I remember correctly on iOS 6, that was pretty much all you had to do. And I'm sure that's probably about all you have to do on this one. However, it seems like this jailbreak has taken a little bit longer than the iOS 6 version did. But, you know, I can't really remember exactly. But we're almost to the end, looks like. And the device is trying to come back up. So I'm, I was assume when it comes back up, we'll be rocking and rolling. It's back up. Let me slide unlock. Now, let's see what we're doing here. Now, I'm going to bring, bring back up AirPlay so you guys can see what's happening. Um, And it, and, it, and it crashed. I don't know if I crashed it trying to bring it back up. I don't. I shouldn't say it crashed. It tried to reboot. 
So let's hit exit. All right, guys, uh, I'm going to show you what the iOS 7 jailbreak looks like. So as you can see here, we're on iOS 7, and we have the jailbreak right here, Cydia, you see. So let's tap that. And this is the first time that I've logged in, so it has to go through all this preparing Cydia file system stuff to set up Cydia. Once that comes up, then you'll be ready to download whatever it is you want on Cydia. And I would check to make sure that everything is iOS 7 compatible before I downloaded it. Uh, it probably wouldn't install anyway, but it could damage your device. And we don't want anything like that to happen. So I don't know exactly how long this is going to take, but we'll come back. Okay, it's going to reboot right now. So I'll go ahead and keep you in here so you'll know exactly how long it takes. And once this reboots, I'm sure that Cydia probably will be ready to go. And I'm going to say that I am a hacker, but you probably should hit that you're just a user. And now right here, you see we're inside Cydia. And there's not really much, nothing on my device right now, so there's nothing to show. But I will be, uh, I'm going to upgrade Essential. And I will be doing iOS 7 jailbreak tweaks, so stay tuned for that. And you may just learn something. So right here you see you got all your different packages in here. Everything's showing up like it should. Here's your manage tab. You see if I go into packages, this is just what's installed when they do the actual jailbreak. Here's your search. And back to Cydia. Hope you enjoyed it, guys. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and keep coming back.